Hello and welcome to apparently lagi. Ah, hello and welcome to episode 35 of Daggerfall. Hello, Master Vampire. I don't have a anchor set again. So I am going to have to go back manually. Luckily I know the way. Last time I spoke to the King of Worms, Flubber Worms mostly, uh, but perhaps some Earthworms and um, what are those things called? Tape worms too, and um, he gave me some knowledge, mostly also a talisman, I think. But the knowledge was that the Under King um, he used to be an imperial battle mage. Well, now I am going to retrieve. <sighs> What's it called? A painting for Queen Akorithi. From... Which castle was it? Hmm. Gotta check it. Castle Veyrest. No. So, travel to the rest. Cautiously, I want to have my shirt repaired. Bunch of level ups, good. Well, s skill ups. Now. <clears throat> What's going on? I don't know, but I'll check my inventory. How much do I need to sell? Well, the broadsword, this stuff. I have a bit of stuff I need to sell from the wagon. For now, let's equip this shirt. No. I'll sell it. I don't need it under the armor. So, yeah. First, I'm going to go find a shop and uh, get my stuff, um, well, repair my, what's it called, short shirt. See you after that. So, I am back. I have sold much of my unneeded stuff. I have confirmed that my helmet is, in fact, uh, dwarven and had put my short shirt, my magical short shirt to be repaired hmm now this will be worrisome yes I need to find a way to get out of bounds hmm I may get into a fight. And as such, I will prepare myself to resist spells. No 
help. No, can't put stuff directly onto the wagon. Okay. That was a bad combat, but at least I won. And my blunt weapon even improved. Gonna save afterward, though. Is there here where the center is? Yes. <coughs> Nothing is Alvin or better. Some a bunch of corpses. <laughs> I don't want to use the teleporter. Indeed, it's one. <coughs> hmm. A floating candlestick. The bed must have made it floaty. I should remember that that is. I should uh, remember that that is a teleporter, but also I should make a mark. And more centers here. Let's see what's down there. Hello, <coughs> 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 Centaur. <coughs> Why did she have three shields on her and two chain caresses plus a leather caress? She couldn't wear all of that. <laughs> also, caress is from caress boily mean meaning. Boiled leather, <laughs> making it funny as most of them aren't made of leather, even if they are called leather in French. At least I think that caress, uh, the caress part means leather. I should check it. English to French Cool Le cool uh, meaning leather or hide so yeah Return C U I R
Es sind coole S. So ja. Yeah. What the uh, wear on their chest is called leather even if it's not really made of leather. Chopping up centaurs. He had a magical tanto. Now it still can't hit the high end enemies which is Still bad, but the centaur had a magical tanto. Hmm. <coughs> okay, black rose that is actually white. Hmm. Does the chain do anything? No. There is only one other exit. Or is there? This lock <coughs> is not afraid of me. So I shall smash the door around it to make it scared. <coughs> no, that. Let's see what magic is on that thing. <laughs> Custom and strikes paralysis. Mm, that would be useful if it could hit um, powerful targets, but it cannot. Oh, but <coughs> and the center. <coughs> Elven Mace Nope Let's see how well will bombing that guy come I missed? How did that happen? Cold breath then? Oh, he's an archer. But he's fighting bats. Now I am fighting bats. <coughs> Silver bat locks.
enemies nearby interesting this room looks important four towers two or four altars four there is something on one of them and this moves the bridge in place and I didn't even know this this place Now I can rest. Nope, enemies nearby. But where? <laughs> oh, a centaur. Still can't cast spells. Much. <laughs> Steel claymore. Hmm. So, I did have some rent for today, and it's Enterprise Doctor's Orders. Uh, first, they have a thing where they have to fly through a place. And uh, it would take um, mm, less than an hour at warp 4, but uh, about uh, 4 days at impulse. Which means that if impulse is light speed, uh, warp 4 is about 1000 times light speed. No, not 1000, 96 times. What the am I messing with? Yeah, 96 times. Which um, I checked online warp tables and it actually fits. Warp 4 should be around 100 times light speed, so 96 times fits. So at least that's good. But then there comes Flox and him being the only person who uh, can stay awake during that time and the thing is perhaps it was supposed to be a surprise that the pole is hallucina hallucination but it uh, made sense because first only Flox was mentioned as being resistant secondly Mm, and that was more important actually that um, <laughs> um, it didn't make sense that Flox would outrank the Paul if uh, she was real and yet it appears as, it appeared as if he did Oh, and there was also the thing where she never actually interacted with any objects and was never shown alone. At least they made that a legitimate thing where the hallucinations didn't actually interact with anything. Unlike some other shows where hallucinations do move stuff and then it's questionable who actually moved it. <coughs> Such as a recent <coughs> Arrow episode where Felicity hallucinates. Fairy dragon scales? They are lighter than actual dragon scales but also less, uh, worth less money. The Brothers of Darkness regarding the Dark Brotherhood, I suppose.
Alright. <laughs> hmm. Perhaps I should return to the big room. Could be through this way. I don't think it is. No. I need to go back east. an archer aren't you <laughs> dwarven left pauldron which is better than my elven but it's too heavy get back up uh, I guess I'll go that way that way and here yep. that's the bigger room I already moved the bridge into position. Now let's see what's here. Rats. Well, one rat, really. No. I should stay near the big room. Even if it has bats and rats. Up here, hmm. If I hadn't moved the bridge, I could have collected that stuff. But I have. And I don't have functional levitation yet. Now should I go right or left? I should heal up, even if I'm not very wounded. I should have gone the other way. It has not been locked. Well, too bad. Well, I was wrong. This is a dead end, so I'll have to go down. Oh. Now I'm at the other side and this moves the bridge back out of position. I'll be returning via teleportation so I won't be collecting that money anyway. There's a 
hallway and this is a room more rooms Nothing actually that useful. Nothing up here. No secret doors. So let's go. my healing spell soon hmm. right out now and rest back up here that's not good Oh yeah, I went down there. No, I went that way and up here. So let's see what's this way. Nothing. This whole thing was pointless. That's annoying. Let's at least see what's down here. Money. see secret doors down here so wait no I do see something it's not secret though and I should have really used slow falling when going down there The scrap of parchment shows the location of Perastil Laboratory. You record it on your map. Interesting. But it's about time I end the episode, so see you in episode 36, where I hopefully find the painting.